How to Eat to Live, Book 2, by the Most Honorable Elijah Muhammad. Chapter 6, Proper Foods, Spiritually and Physically. Eat to live and not to die. The Bible teaches us that God, in the end of the world, when he comes, will prolong the people's lives because they have been eating the proper foods, both spiritually and physically. We have to accept it. That is, if we love life and not death. Living less than 100 years is a very short life. People in this world admire one who lives to see 90 years, which is a very short life because of the way they live, eat and drink the wrong foods and drinks. They are surprised to see a person live over 70 years. Now, they want drugs to give you life. Drugs cannot prolong our lives if we are going to eat and drink the wrong food and drink, and drink polluted water. The very water we drink is polluted from filth. We make the water filthy with our own refuse and then turn around calling ourselves cleaning the water to make it fit to drink. This is not because the government is too poor to try and see that its citizens have pure water to drink. It is not because the government is too poor that we have to eat the poor and poisonous foods. They deliberately cause this drink and food to be impure. Just read what they say about the impure water that we drink out of Lake Michigan and other rivers. The government permits the deliberate making of alcoholic drinks which it knows are not good. For a person who has no limitation on how much of it he drinks. And it deliberately turns out millions and millions of dollars worth of hogs to put on the market, knowing that the hog is poison and was not made for human consumption. They do that to oppose the right foods, the pure foods that God has given them in abundance. Anytime we break the law of nature, we are doing harm to ourselves. The government condemns smoking, but still permits tobacco to be sold to the public. All of this is due to commercializing on that which produces a short life. Part of the population of the country is being addicted to drugs for the purpose of experimenting with drugs instead of lengthening the life by what we eat and drink. If we know the best food and the best drink, we should try to get them for ourselves and not charge the government with our own foolish acts just because the government will not stop the sale of such detrimental food and drink. The government could not sell one drop of whiskey unless we buy it. The foolish buyer is the one to be charged. We have fire, but if we do not use it rightly, it is because of our own foolishness. If you know better, then do better for self. Eat good food once a day. Purchase the books, CDs, and DVDs of the life-giving teachings at store.finalcall.com. Listen to the messages of the Honorable Minister Louis Farrakhan 24-7 at finalcallradio.com. Watch the Nation of Islam's weekly and live broadcasts at NOI.org.